don't, sweetheart, me. If you don't mean it, don't say sweet words if they're not true. Don't tear my heart like it was paper. You know my heart murdered loves only you. To this project because I don't have the rest of the items that I need for it. I was gonna go to the store and buy a bunch of like little fake flowers, probably like pinks, whites, yellows, whatever. And you put you hot glue them onto the letters or whatever, and you just go ahead and hang them up on the wall or put them in a frame or however you want to do. But I'm gonna have to go ahead and come back to this one because I don't have the rest of the stuff, and I'm just gonna go ahead and show you another project that I'm starting, anyways. Alright, so I went ahead and started making this. Um, I'm going to make like a little dream catcher. This is just the inside part of the other part of this thingy. I don't know what they're called, but yeah, that's the inside part. And I wanted this to be covered with the burlap. Um, I got the burlap. It was in a like five foot roll. Got it at Walmart for like six bucks, five bucks, something like that. Got my hot glue gun. Oh crap. Hot glue gun, glue stuff. And the little parts that I'm putting together right here are fabrics from Nellie Grace's old bedding. Well, not from her old bedding, but leftover pieces from her bedding that we had made. So I'm just going to go ahead and cut up little scraps of it. I got this one and this one. And I still have a whole little part of it. That's the other part of the Nellie Grace project that I'm doing. But I don't have the flowers to finish it. So I just went ahead and put that aside. So yeah, so I just got to keep, you know, cutting little strips out and tying them together at the end like that and then once I'm done with tying the pieces together I have these flowers that I bought from Walmart as well I'm going to go ahead and put them on the outside part of it got two of those and then one of the, these just to offset it I'm going to hot glue that to the other spot of it as well um, so for right now that's all I ended up making this as well I got all these ideas off of Pinterest um, I'm going to use this for the corner of Nellie Grace's room. I use one of these things as well. Um, so, yeah, this was our bed sheet to our bed. Lennon did not like using it because I didn't want to sleep under it. So, uh, no, I, I didn't want to sleep under it. Lennon wanted to. Lennon wanted to sleep under the bed sheet, and I didn't want to. That I felt like that was just weird, so we just took it off, and I told him, you know what, fine, I'll just go ahead and make that for Nellie Grace's um, little corner of the room, like a little canopy. So I had to went and did that. Yeah, so I did I didn't think about recording it when I was making it. I was really into it watching Netflix as well. Um I got it off of Pinterest. I just used these little two things. Um the bed sheet has this little um spot right here that is enough room to fit it in there. I just went ahead and cut it open. I went ahead and put the bed sheet all the way through around. And then the smaller part, you get two pieces of string. Tie it around one way, tie it around the other way, tie them together in the middle. And you may want to make sure that it's lower than the one on top so you're able to hang it. And just go ahead and set it up. I'm sorry I didn't record it when I was doing it. I wasn't thinking, but whatever. I'll go ahead and show y'all whenever I finish that and hang it up. So, 
Yeah. The projects that I'm doing right now to keep myself entertained at home, I went ahead and uh, asked Lana if we could go ahead and buy a sewing machine because I've been wanting one because I have so many projects that I want to do, but it includes a sewing machine. So we went ahead and got one yesterday, but I, this is the one that we got at Walmart. It was only $68, you know, just the basic one, whatever. Went ahead and got some threads and some yarn for this other project. So, yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and start the other project that I was showing y'all that had the little hoop thing and the fabric. So I'm going to go ahead and start that and catch y'all up when I'm done with it. Don't sweetheart me if you don't mean it. Don't say sweet words if they're not true. Don't tell my heart like it was paper. You know my heart murdered love's home. semi-finished product I stopped right there because I liked how full it was um, I'm not gonna go ahead and use this part that I had on earlier because it doesn't fit close so I'm just gonna throw that part away then all the next thing I got to do is cut the flowers off cut those flowers off into pieces and I'm gonna go ahead and put them here in the corners of it and style it like however it fits well and hot glue it on there and after that I should be done depending on how well these flowers stick there's the landing so enthusiastic again <laughs> I'm gonna, go yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put the flowers like that one two and the other one and then I'll probably add some more stuff to it later on, whatever, when I buy other stuff, so. But, right now it's 38 degrees outside. It is absolutely freezing. Landon's going outside. Come look in the chairs. Look in the chairs. Why? Look in the chairs. Look in the chairs. <gasps> oh, look, there's little snow. <sighs> it's so freezing. The dogs have been inside and this is how they keep warm by wrestling around. Are you gonna put that on so we can see the snow in the morning? No. Huh? Are you licking all the snow right now? Do you see them? It is actually snowing. I mean they're just like little flurries. But it's still snowing. <laughs> it's freezing. Yeah, look, here's the little bit that came out from earlier. You can see little pieces here flying around in the air, but it's not enough to catch on camera because they're kind of still small. Just a little bit of flurries. So. All over this. <laughs> Sorry, I'm shaking so much. I'm freezing. Uh, I can't stay outside. It is freaking cold. Uh, maybe if I was dressed a little bit better, but I'm not. I've just got like a sweater on and some little pants and just socks. So. <sighs> wait for when it's full on snowing because it'll be the first time I actually see snow falling. Lennon's lived like somewhere. Lennon's been somewhere with snow before. The water off the hot. It's so, super hot. It's real hot. So it's not fair, whatever. But this will be the first time that I actually get to see actual snow. Like San Antonio, we got the little frost over and everything, but that's all. But yay, we're excited. Hopefully it's, we'll get some snow, really good snow by what, Saturday it says? Yeah. We'll have some snow by Saturday, so. And Nelly Grace, this is your first snow too. But you're not gonna go outside when it's snowing unless we bundle you up, right? Why? Well, and she doesn't want her blanket on. I had to take off her her onesie that she was wearing earlier because she soaked it with slobber from her mittens. Just took it off, whatever. It just took it off when I was feeding her. So, but look, she's got to hang that thumb in there. Right, Nelly Grace? 
Ray Sugar Bear, yes, man. <laughs> See, I just wrap her up with her blanket and she kicks it off. She's also learned how to roll over on her little mat. Go ahead and put, show y'all real quick. And she did it! Yay! So yeah, that was Nellie Grace rolling over. That happened earlier today. She thinks she's such a big girl. She's not. She's only three months old. But she knows I'm talking about her. That's why she keeps looking at me. Alright, so now... Ah! <laughs> earlier I scared the crap out of Lana. She tried to scare me. But we gotta bring the dogs through the garage because it's getting, it's getting wet and making their feet muddy outside. So, gotta bring these folds in through here. What? Oh! <laughs> Duh, they would have gone right through the house if I didn't close this door. Yeah, sometimes I'm a little goofy. Come on! Look at them. They're like, oh, it's freezing! Lana, come on! Let's go get our brownies. Wilson! Come on! You doof, come on. You like, Mom, she can freeze outside. Oh, look at her. It smells a lot like brownies. What if we wake up tomorrow? So we had to put our brownies in um, cupcake tins because we don't have a baking sheet that has room for brownies. Yeah. Last time we made brownies, went and made them really just like, recorded me like wiping my nose. He <laughs> made brownies like this big, so we got muffin brownies this time. Talk to the camera. Say how lovely you are. Talk. I'm lovely. Words, words, words. Talk to the hand. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna start getting back to the doing the crafts or whatever, so we can hurry up and finish this thing because it's going on for too long. So let's get it started, right, Nelly Grace. Right! Yeah! You've heard the great love stories of romance from years gone by But we could top them all, babe, with a tale of you and I We'd make a great duet, like Scarlet when with Red Our Romeo, you if you'll be my Juliet Tell me, tell me that you love me Well, tell me, tell me, tell me, babe, you're my Yes, I swear to you, ours will be the greatest story ever told. Let's get on it now. Okay, so here is the semi-finished part. I don't know if I want to put these other flowers in because this one's kind of like... The way it opens is like stupid and ugly, whatever. And this one's, you know, just a little bud. I might just, I don't know. I really like the way it looks without this pink one. Um, it came out really nice, actually. All right, so this is it standing up, standing up, hanging down. Can't really tell, but it's like so I finished both of my projects. Landon's starting another one. That's gonna be for another show. Um, another show. Another uh, video. So he's making bookshelves over there in the garage. All right, well, I'm all finished and done. I'm all finished done doing that little project. Finished two, actually. I still have to finish the Nellie Grace one. Hopefully I can do that one by next week. But that's all for now. Thank you. Bye. Thank you.